Oh, how long ago did you cure the first? 1984. Okay. 1984. These documents, what they show is that we cure AIDS from a positive to a negative HIV level. Here is one. This is from the Italian hospital. HIV positive. Hospital Vicente Di Antoni. He is positive. In the next page, from the same hospital, the same young man, Oswald Zavala, he is negative. The Attorney General, Mr. Robert Abraham, went on the air and said that he would have put me not in jail. He would have put me under the jail. I was looking at him saying that right here in New York on television. I watched him say that. But I knew that this white man didn't know that there was one black man stashed away someplace that has never been to school and doesn't read books. And that that black man by not going to school, is coming with a different premise, a different foundation. He was totally unaware. I knew that. I knew he was helpless. So when he said that he's going to put me under the jail, I said he's in for a big surprise. When I went to court on the Thursday, the judge said that I would have to bring one of every patient. AIDS, blindness, diabetes, lupus, herpes, sickle cell, Impotence, paralysis, and others. Nine. I didn't take nine to the Supreme Court. I took 77 people with accredited medical documents, diagnostic sheets. And the judge go like this. I only want nine. Well, needless to say, with that kind of presentation and giving and ex exhibiting this, the Jews came back and said, practicing medicine without a license, not guilty, because he doesn't sell medicine. The Lancaster Laboratories identify our product as being natural, vegetation, cell food. Not guilty for claiming that he cure AIDS, because he does, and he has proven it. One of the things that we found in the treatment of AIDS is this. Two things we have to do simultaneously. One of them is to remove the cause of the presence of the mucus, which there is something in the intestines that need to be removed. Simultaneously, we have to nourish the body back to health, which requires two substances. It's a compound of calcium and the other is iron. But we, when we talk about iron, we have to be very careful. Because there are two forms of iron. One that is ferrosulfate. That iron would cause you to bind and prevent you from using the toilet. But the other iron is a vegetable iron. One that is obtained from plants, such as the sarsaparilla, the burdock, the yellow dog such as the, uh, the one that we get from Honduras, the guaco, the contribu, the hombre grande. All these herbs are heavily laden with iron. Upon giving this to the patient, you will see that the condition will be changing immediately. One patient will be burst in 17 days. Alex Suarez in Honduras. And, what, and was the AIDS at a level of um, almost dying? What they call HIV positive, it was a carposis sarcoma. So you know you're on your way out. You see, again, when I make the statement that I cure AIDS, it is impossible, virtually impossible, to believe that the statement is correct and true. Two, two reasons. First reason, the physician claims that there is no cure for AIDS. Yes. But why should we take the word of the physician? What disease have we killed in 500 years? using inorganic and carcinogenic chemicals. He has not cured anyone. So when he tells us that there is no cure for AIDS, well, what's new? So you cured AIDS by cleaning the body first? And by cleansing it? the cause of AIDS, which is the mucous membrane. The second reason 
why it is difficult for my brothers, especially my brothers and sisters, to understand and to believe it, is because if a white man doesn't do it, how could you? And if you're doing it, how come they're not promoting you? Yeah. But I ask you the question, my black race, why should the white man promote me or us? Who should be the promoting them or us? And because we have been so compromised, we begin to see that the prejudices that we have against each other ain't working.